White Sox hosting the Mariners. The Mariners are minus 138 on the money line. The White Sox are plus 118. The over-under is 7.5 runs. The Mariners laying a run and a half on the run line are plus 125, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win by two or more. And the White Sox getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 150, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. And I took a shot with the White Sox today, and yeah, their losing streak just continues now. It's at 12 games. It's supposed to be 82 degrees, 9 mile an hour winds blowing in, and no rain tomorrow. Wu pitched twice against the White Sox last year. Four innings, one run, one earned. They won 6-3 in Chicago. He struck out three. Five and two-thirds, two runs, two earned. They won 3-2. He struck out nine. Fetty pitched once against the Mariners this year. Seven innings, one run, one earned. They lost 8-4. That was in Seattle. He struck out four. Head-to-head, the Mariners are 7-3. The road team's on a two-game winning streak. The home team is 5-5. Five five. The favorite is 7-3 on the money line. The favorite or the underdog getting or laying runs is 5-5. Five five. There have been five one-run games in their last 10, and the Mariners scored eight runs in the first inning today and just completely took the game over. The over-under is 4-4-2, four, four and two, and the over-under at 7.5 runs is 5-5. Five five. Now, if you happen to catch the over-under at 7, it's also 4-4-2, four, four and two, so that half a run does make a difference. The Mariners are 2-3 and three in Wu's last five starts. The over is hitting his last two. The over is 3-1-1. One, and one. Four and a third innings pitched, 4.8 hits, two earned runs, 3.2 strikeouts, 0.6 walks, 0.6 home runs. He's given up home runs in back-to-back starts. 69.6 pitches per game, 16.6 pitches per inning. And for Fetty, they're two and three in his last five starts. The under is hitting his last two. Six innings pitched, four hits, 1.8 runs, 1.8 of which were earned, 4.2 strikeouts, 1.8 walks, 0.8 home runs. He gave up two in his last start. 91.8 91.8 pitches per game, 15.3 pitches per inning. And like I said, there's, there's certain teams where the pitcher just gets no run support. The Mariners are 2-8 and eight in their last 10. Four runs, six runs, three runs, 10 runs. One run in a loss, one run in three consecutive losses, and then 10 runs in the win today against the White Sox. And the White Sox are on a 12-game losing streak. Five runs, 12 runs, three runs, 10 runs. Two runs in a loss, two runs in a loss, one run in a loss, shut out in a loss. Mariners with the money line, Mariners laying the runs. I'm going under. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.